what's popping? Welcome to my little corner of heaven, y'all. I'm gonna give y'all a little quick reading. Um, I actually don't know how fast it's gonna be. Y'all know how spirit be. But I'm gonna give y'all a little something, something, okay? I got you rigged it up here at a little angle. It's been a minute. I will give y'all tarot card readings every day, like, you know, if I could. <laughs> but other stuff do come up. I am a full-time artist and I have paint on my hands right now. I am a full-time artist. I was getting down, getting dirty, mixing stuff, wiping stuff everywhere. I got my paint pans on. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm, I am a full-time artist and full-time tarot reader, full-time spiritualist, okay? I practice hoodoo, okay? I practice um, a lot of different things you will see on my channel, but sometimes <clears throat> I get a little sidetrack you know but i'm here trying to offer y'all some things to guide the way today oops today spirit chose some pyrite some clear quartz and some rose quartz okay so let's play a little game see if you can pick your pal just pause it right try to pick your pal and then i'm gonna put the the rose quartz you know on each pal I mean, not the rose quartz on each pile, Lord. Maybe each pile needs some rose quartz. I actually been wearing my rose quartz and stuff. But, um, yeah, maybe you actually need some rose quartz because I've made a mistake and said that. But I'm going to put the rose quartz, the clear quartz, and the pyrite on, you know, the pile that my spirit guys chose. So. And no, I don't know what's in here. And then this was right here. And then this is right here. Hey! So, this is part number one, this is part number two, this is part number three, just in case, just in case you didn't know, and just in case you are new to this channel, I do $20 tarot for our readings for 20 minutes. Anything after the $20 minute minimum is a dollar a minute, it's a dollar a minute, hey! Anybody from the whole wide world can order tarot card readings from moi. Okay, me up, you know. <laughs> I just heard critically acclaimed. I'm critically acclaimed. I'm hot and pop. I just went. But yeah, I'm, I'm good at my job. That's something that I do stand behind confidently, you know. Check me out. Make sure you like, 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 comment, 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 share, 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 and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Let's get into it, pal number one. What's up, pal number one? We have Rose Quartz. It's very good for the heart chakra. Self love, healing your heart space, letting go of certain promises wow letting go of certain traumas but i guess that's something that meant oh my god why well, i hear that song i'm sick and tired of all your broken promises promises that's actually not funny because i got a gap okay so you may so you might have a gap or a lisp but like you know i actually like her what was her name aqua maybe you look like her i don't know i just heard perm maybe you got perm hair maybe you got weave maybe you want long hair maybe you want weave Natural hair. I just heard a little wing. I will. I like them long hair, thick red bone. You may look like that, something like that. I'm not sure. You may be the total opposite of that. I'm not sure. Comment below. I would love to hear about it. But we got your rose quartz here, and this is news. Oh my God! Why well, forget to introduce? Look, it's been a minute. I'm not on it. I'm not on it. You may not be on it, but this is your news. You got judgment, the nine of pentacles, and the ace of cups damn damn i'm honestly sick of delivering this message but i know i have to like bro i watch my own videos like if my spirits like telling me go watch some of your old videos i watch it and you know it listening to myself say the things that i already believe yeah like channeling different messages it make it stick more you know so sometimes I gotta say messages over and over and over again that's not necessarily applying to me right now or applied to my past so, and it's like annoying me but it's bad that it annoys me because this is my job this is what I gotta do but judgment is being called on your finances and whatever happens just walk away from it okay it's something that you're doing with your finances that you're not supposed to be doing I just heard of mismanagement you're not understanding. <laughs> You're not understanding. Look, I literally been through this. Like, I used to spend my money on weed. Like, 
Bro, in high school, I used to spend my money on clothes. Because school supplies and shit. Like, my mom stopped buying me school supplies when I was young as fuck. Um, but, yeah, like, school supplies, I used to have to buy my own clothes. But other than that, I used to buy weed. Like, I would barely save my money unless I knew I was going on vacation. Or if I was, like, you know, investing into my hair or something like that. Like, as a teenager, like, I really didn't start, um buying my own groceries and stuff that's one thing my mama did do was buy groceries but i would buy my you know other stuff like fruits and stuff like that but one thing i had to learn how to do was buy groceries and spend money well and compare prices and all that other stuff when i was 18 i had to walk to work like i had a whole money management like you're financially illiterate and this is not a bad thing because we everybody don't know something so I don't want you to think that I'm like ragging on you but your financial literacy is literally lacking like you your money could be tripling right now but you don't know how to I was about to say you don't know how to deal with it but you don't know how to spend it that's what spirits telling me like I'm so glad that it ain't it's nothing wrong with living a luxury lifestyle because that's what I'm gonna do too like I practice minimalism just because I'm 22 years old. So to me, I'm the type of person that think about, sorry, sorry if I'm going too deep into this, but it's spirit and I'm going to try to shorten as much as I can. Bro, for some reason, I've been looking at like famous people's ages, right? I've been looking at their ages and how they conduct themselves, but that's another, I, it's not pulling me to the how they conduct themselves part. So I'm going to just give y'all some, some the part about money management and success and foundation okay so for example scissor whoa this shit lining up like a motherfucker scissor this is a great example Ugh. so i was looking at an interview of her and she was like talking about her weight gain when she had gained weight and stuff like that um and she was like yeah i was just eating like she's just like i'm wealthy now like i was just eating I'm fat, so y'all don't think I'm being mean to y'all. And I, I'm this not about weight at all. This is just about what she said. I'm finna continue. She's like, yeah, I was just eating and going out and shopping and eating and going out and shopping. Like, you know, type shit. And that's cool or whatever. But she also said that was when she was young. A lot of people look at SZA and see how, like, lively she is. You know, black don't crack. Bro, SZA is 30. Ari Lennox is, like, 33. Like... Some of these people is over 30 and they influence young minds so much. Like we see this, this is what I was talking about, like with clothes. So like somebody could be like 20, let's just say 19 to 21 and they want to look like these 30 year old women. And it's just like, it's okay to do that stuff. Sometimes it's okay to do that stuff, stuff most of the time. But, you know, it's more okay to have balance between all of those things, you know? I don't know. Like, maybe you should donate some money. And not donate just because, you know, I got the money, I'm going to donate it just because she's so many donate. Like, no, genuinely find somebody and, like, donate. Like, support somebody's business. Or save or invest in a stock. <laughs> like, invest in yourself. Like, what do you need? Do you need some shoes? Do you need to invest in a hair care system? Do you want to, I don't know, do you want to, I don't know, get your nails done? Do you want to get your feet done? I don't know. That's, a lot of people are like, oh, get your nails done. That's superficial. Um, But I'm like, oh, well, I got to make a video about that, about the members only club. But um, <laughs> my friend is from PR and she sent me some of her nails for free. So yeah, that's, that's a whole nother video though. Um. And they're, they, bro, I just know they're going to be real pretty. I actually can't wait to get them. I think my size and kid is in the mail already. I got to go get it. But that's besides the point. Some people actually need those things. Like, do your feet hurt? Do you need a massage? Like, you need to practice some self-love and self-care and, like, stop keeping up with the Joneses because just think if you didn't have all those things. Like, I'm so glad that I am in hermit mode. Like, I was thinking to myself and thinking about all these artists that, like, are popping. Like, popping, popping, and they 25 and up, 30 and up, almost 
40 years old like I was like damn my prime can really hit like whenever like and I asked myself would I be happy with myself if I had to spend another quarantine 2022 and I genuinely said yes I was like look at all the things I could do in that time like I always say work on it now and enjoy it later especially if you know you broke I'm not rich, I'm not wealthy, but for the people that's broke and be complaining about them being broke, like y'all being broke, bro, get it together, like, spirit call and judgment on certain things, like, I just had a vision of, like, just imagine a table and there's, like, I just heard a wine, just imagine a table and it's, like, red wine, you might like red wine, that's cool, that's actually very good for your health, but, um, <laughs> sorry, y'all, <laughs> so just picture a table and it's got food and everything great on it, right? And somebody just grabbed the fucking cloth and ripped the shit off, but it don't go how you think it's going to go. It actually, like, pulls all of the shit off the table. I feel like spirit is doing it to you and testing you whether you can stay there or walk away. I just heard fights, too. I don't know. But, yeah, this is your message. I'm going to cut it off right here. This is very long. It was 11-11 on the clock. Um, just so you know, I do $20 tarot card readings for 20 minutes. Anything after the $20 minute minimum is a dollar a minute. It's a dollar a minute. Hey. 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 Sorry, I just got so lit. Um, just so you know, um, anybody from around the world can order tarot card readings from my check out my website link in my description make sure you like 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 comment 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 share 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 and subscribe 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 i hope this helped i'm actually feeling like a i just heard that uh little yachty tiptoe on tubes with me like i hope you know i feel like i'm the i don't know i feel like feelings are getting hurt <laughs> I'm sorry. If, if Spear had to tell me via dreams, signs, bad things, me arguing with people, and you got told in a tarot card reading instead of it coming out on your outside world as something like dramatic and chaotic, like, just be grateful and, like, give me a high five or a hug or something like damn, Peace. <laughs> Bro, pile number two. Pile number one was really long. Some of you might need to watch pile number one i also just burp sorry if that's weird but i also just burp and i tasted my fruit that i ate and it's weird how i tasted my fruit right because i definitely just had cabbages after my smoothies so yeah i was you know you expected it to taste like cabbages but it tastes like fruit but maybe you need to eat some more fruits and vegetables oh my god spirit is being really vulgar um Maybe you should um get into feminine wellness. Like, what's wrong with your vagina? Stuff be happening. Like, stuff can just throw our pH off. Food can throw our pH off. Stress can throw our pH off. Having sex with, even if the dude clean, like, just having sex with somebody new can throw our pH off. So, like, you know, you, we just have to learn. Like, it's a lot of new things I'm doing. Like, my pH has been balanced for... I'm pretty petty now. I, well, I'm celibate, so of course it would be balanced. No no disrespect to y'all if y'all having sex, as long as it's spiritually, emotionally, and physically um, healthy or whatever. But um, ain't nothing wrong with that as long as you're doing it right. But um, I'm celibate, so that's probably why you know I could keep everything together easier because it's just me. But, you know, maybe you need to... Oh my God, why is spirit being rude? That be, spirit's not being rude. Let me take that back. Spirit's not being rude. They're being aggressive. Like, I just heard, watch who you lay with. Like, I don't know. Um, yeah. Not finna put it on them. It can come from anything. It can come from dairy, bro. It can come from having your drawers too tight. It can come from you being allergic to different, like, soaps and fragrances. Like, you know, it can come from anything. Just, just, you know, you gotta learn what the kitty like, okay? <laughs> These readings is getting so long. You have the Four of Cups, the Hangman, and the Three of Pentacles. I'm tired of your broken promises, promises. <laughs> yo. Um. Yo. Yo, what's, what's going on, bro? What's up, bro? You need to watch pound number one, bro. Who is energy taking over the read? Okay, so... 
I just heard sunshine, blue skies, please go away. My girl done found another and gone away. Man, what the fuck going on with you, bro? With her went my future. My life just turned to gloom. But day after day, um, I'm just finna work so it can distract me. <laughs> That's what the Three of Pentacles is giving me with the hey man. Okay, um, what else am I getting from this? Um, oh my god. I know to you it might sound strange, but I wish it would rain. Sorry, my voice sounds terrible. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nah, that's for real what I'm getting. That's your whole read for real. <laughs> but yeah, this four of cups, bro. Like, what the fuck is you on? Like, bro, something. Bro, what the fuck is you on? This this ungrateful shit bugging me. This ungrateful shit bugging me. Like, I had to talk to uh, uh, this person, this very important person. And I was telling them, like, this ungrateful shit with these beings are bugging me. Like, bro, like, this ungrateful shit bugging me. Like, I was really cold yesterday night. And I don't know what happened when you cold, but you just start thinking about shit. And I just started thinking about homeless people, like, damn. And I was like, damn, just think how long it takes for their body to, like, get used to it. Like, just think if somebody took you out of your comfortable ass house and put your fucking ungrateful ass in an igloo is you gonna be comfortable in a motherfucking igloo i don't like cold weather like that so unless i have me a whole bunch of furs on and a fire in that bitch <laughs> i'm not finna be comfortable nigga so what's, what the fuck is going on i think about it all the time bro the other day i was thinking about how when i was like eight or something like that my my grandma didn't pay her bills. Her fucking lights was off as fuck in a tan trailer. Bro, why was I the only grandchild there with her hot as a bitch? Like, why? Laying on there. We not eating fruits. We not eating vegetables. That's why the fuck I had to go through my weight loss transformation and still going through my weight loss transformation right now. No, I was fucking, couldn't fucking breathe in that goddamn tan trailer. Doors ain't open. Windows ain't open or nothing. I got a tan inside the trailer. <laughs> like, you ungrateful as hell. <laughs> it's like get a new perspective. Like, look, spirit just showed me this. It's weird because I'm having, I ain't never had a vision like that. Like, I've had visions, of course, but I have never had a vision like this. This is a, this is a Winkle Bottom Tarot first for me to flip this up that side down. Spirit is saying, oh my God, why are you doing this to me? It's Diana Ross. Upside down, boy, you turn me. Look, I don't know what the fuck going on with you, but you need to turn your ass right side up and get a new perspective and get this work. Okay, learn how to work well with people. And if I just got another message, stop mixing pleasure and business. Stop. Okay, I just heard Bobby and Whitney. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Please get help. But yeah, you just need a total clearing of your energy. A lot of y'all need to get regained. um yeah y'all y'all need a total reset like a total boost i'm hearing about motivite too y'all probably need to get some motivite i've been going strong with my motivite i'm happy a lot of people abuse motivite i still ain't made my big motivite videos yet but it's coming at the perfect time i believe um so yeah that's what i got for you pal number two i'm pretty sure i'm gonna lose some subscribers over this one just so you know i do <laughs> $20 readings for 20 minutes. Anything after the $20 minute minimum is a dollar a minute. It's a dollar a minute. Hey. Make sure you like, 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 comment, 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 share, 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 subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And remember, you can order tarot card readings for me if you don't live in the U.S. You just gotta speak English. You just gotta speak English. <laughs> so, yeah, bye. All right, you got the pyrite stone, power number three. Bro, power number three, shit is actually pretty wild. What is the news? What's the news, bruh? What? Cool. Okay, so I think you're getting, um, I just heard. One more chance. Baby, give me one more chance. Baby, give me one more chance. Well, yeah, I'm hearing one more chance. 
by Faith Evans. Okay, she's so cute. Faith Evans is so goddamn cute. She even aged well, but you could tell she aged stressed. But she aged well. That's how I feel about my mother. Wow. Um I make wow, this reading is crazy. Um I make it a habit to not overwork myself. So a woman overworking and being hella fucking masculine is like a karma thing in my bloodline, which is okay. Um it's not the worst that can happen. We can have way much worse. We can be serial killers or something, okay? So stay with me, stay with me. Um fine tune your feminine energy is something that really influenced me to fine tune my feminine energy was comparing me and my mother and the females in my family the men they attract how much hard work they feel like they should do like come on now i used to have a job when i was 15 years old i used to walk to work i used to pull long hours i used to sleep in a fucking uh cafeteria in the break room at my mom's job to go to work and to go to college i used to sleep at college all day like my work was always done because i literally slept in that hole until I had to move because something happened or whatever. Like, I'm just a naturally hardworking person. I was always on my feet doing laborer jobs. And let me let me put you on something. I, I'm a full-time artist. And um, I'm a tarot reader. And I sell spiritual stuff, right? Bro. Like, I literally paint standing up. Like, I can't do it no more. Like, I used to, you know, try to work out a lot. To I still work out, you know, as best as I can. Because I've, I've been spasming a lot this past week. But, um... I used to work out the combat, you know, so I wouldn't get lazy. But that wasn't enough because I was on my feet all the time. And when you're on your feet all the time, your hip joints get flat, especially if you're someone that carries weight. And be on your feet, your hip joints get flat. You lose your arches in your feet. And, you know, that shit hurts, like, bro. But basically, you're getting another chance. You're manifesting a new opportunity to learn how to juggle your money. And it's crazy because y'all try to pick another pile because... And pile number one, I really didn't want to give that message. Like, I'm sick of saying that message. Like, bro, the past two years of my life has been learning money management, right? Not even past past two years, 20. Yeah. I used to just party. Party all the time. Party all the time. Party all the time. But, um, yeah, I used to just party. I used to just party, party, party. I did not save my money. I didn't have no plans to save my money. I just used to smoke it. <laughs> and hang out with people and pay for food and other expenses do I hear somebody outside that was really close the way I heard that it was kind of but yeah like I was saying um so of course my spirits put that message in pound of one they've been putting it in my face and like it's a collective thing too, so I keep having to say it and say it and say it, and I feel like that's my destiny to say it and say it and say it, so it could be put into my psyche, into my DNA, like so it could be like cinched into my spirit that managing money is a big thing, especially when you start reeking in the motherfucking thousands. But when you start managing money when you only got a couple hundred, nigga, when the universe see you managing money when you got a couple of pennies, bro. They will rub your pennies together. They will make your two pennies hump and make a dog, swear to God. So, <laughs> I feel like, I feel like, I feel like you my dog. I'm sorry. I know y'all probably, oh my God, has this coming up. But seriously, like, I'm for real, 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 for real. Telling you some real shit. You manifested some type of new beginning, bro. Balance your coins, bro. Balance your shit. You got the pie right, okay? Maybe you need to, um, you know, add a protective element to your finances. Put some protection spells on your business, on your income. Like, bro, you that makes all the difference. Make you a goddamn money jar. Do some, do some stuff like that. Like, I have my own money jar, but I, I don't think I showed it. I think it's in some of my other videos, but I didn't show me making it just because you know I kept that to me. Like, for some of my protection jars, I'm not putting some of my protection jars online. I have a protection jar video. Like, yeah, look, that's good enough. It got some great information there. I might update one, but um, I didn't want to make my new protection jar. You know, I want to keep it sacred. Like, I do. It's some stuff I don't show everybody, you know. 
So maybe you need a money jar or a protection jar. I actually got two tiny, teeny, tiny money jars on my website. I think one so super, super cheap, super powerful. Check out my website. It has um, the ingredients there. I think. I think it does have the ingredients there. But yeah. So this is all I got for you, pal number three. Have a good one. Blessings. Much love. Peace. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. I do twenty dollar tarot card minutes for twenty minutes. Anything after the twenty dollar minute minimum, it's a dollar a minute. It's a dollar a minute. Good luck blessing these motherfucking finances, bro. Bro, I'm finna get you a um. I'm finna pull you another card to go with that. Pal number three. Can I get one? More card for pal number three. Oh, I just heard. Oh my God, Ace of Cup Law and Travel Law. I just heard. Let me stop. I shouldn't have put it that way. This way. It was actually this way, but I did it like this. But yeah, Travel Love Lord and Travel Lord. I just heard. Um, I just heard. What's that song? So get ready. Oh, get ready. Cause here I come. I'm on my way. His voice is really high. That's cornbread and in the temptations, I think. <clears throat> he said, Oh darling, I'm in love with you. So get ready. So get ready. Cause here I come. I'm on my way. But yeah, anyway, bye.